I want to talk about something that happened this year that I would have never thought that would happen. LeBron James passed Kareem scoring record. Right. Did you ever imagine that that would ever happen? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And i tell you why. Why? Because we're getting players that are uniquely sized, who have unique skills. And he, he, I think he's gotten better as a shooter. Um, he competes his fanny off. I'm a big fan. I'm a big fan. And to, to watch him play, he dominates a game, particularly when there's an open court game. He's going to dominate the game. Mm -hmm. Right. He knows what he's doing. And he lifts, he carries people. They, uh, they, they, they want to play with him. Mm -hmm. Right. They want to play with him. I'm a big fan of his and also for the league itself. Okay. Mm -hmm. It helps every one of these players. And envy and jealousy has no place in the league when it comes to uh, what he contributes to the league or his respective team. Mm -hmm. And I think people get envy and jealousy. Uh, there's envy and jealousy there. Mm -hmm. I don't get it. Yeah. Is that number being – is is his record being broken, do you think? Somebody will break it or not? Yeah. LeBron's. LeBron's. Because well, you're, you're, he's in counting. It's – well, the thing <laughs> that would the, – the biggest thing with me – uh, to try to look at it as easily as you look at it, can somebody stay healthy that long? Yeah, yeah, that's, that's my take on it. Yeah. That that's what it's going to come down to is yeah. who will have a, a <laughs> career injury. Uh, Little LeBron James. I don't know. <laughs> that's a long. <laughs> that's a le that's a, like you know, longevity specialty games now. <laughs> uh, play in playoff. I, I mean, let's get to the point. And I think they're going to have another in the middle of the season something. Mm -hmm. Are those going to count toward those? Uh, I don't think those will. Mm -hmm. But uh, will we have a four-point shot? Will we have a five-point shot? Mm -hmm. Who knows where this game is I going? they don't do that. Yeah. And I would hope that we have sort of reached the saturation point with these kind of gimmick things. Mm -hmm. uh, they're not going to be gimmicks. They're going to stay that way. Mm -hmm. Uh, because they've been popular. Yeah, I think the game is going to get to that. There, there will be a. Uh, there's got to be five point shot. There's, there's, there's got to be an incentive because <laughs> do that, every player is looking the same. Like how you stated, every player is looking the same. So I think for the game to grow, <coughs> now there's got to be a player out there that does something specifically. Now, like this guy is great at this long I see range what you're ball. But five points. It's, it's, it's. I think the game is going to get. to <laughs> I that. I think there's only one player in the NBA right now that can shoot. A five point shot every It's game. not there yet. <laughs> I'm saying, if it was, it's only one. It person. would be. It would be actually. It would be somebody would, during the place in the game when the coach is all, oh, "Don't shoot that! Don't shoot that!" <laughs> and all of a sudden, a guy makes one. Well, he might as well sl slip another one in here. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's a good shot. I just every time I see a sport, um, all sports. I'm a sports fan. When they start changing things. Um, that makes me wonder what's wrong with being traditional. Mm -hmm. right. I'm kind of traditionalist in, in like golf, okay? It was, uh, to see where these guys hit the ball today is mind boggling, okay? It's mind boggling. And, but more importantly, how, how skilled they are. Mm -hmm. right. You just don't hit it out there because you swing at it as hard. They hit it and keep it in play. Mm -hmm. But, uh, as I say, life is, Everyone is always pushing the envelope. You never know what. In sports, are they going to keep pushing the envelope in sports? Jackie, we're in the middle of the NBA Finals. What do you got cooking on prize picks? Man, it's a tight series, so I don't know. I think I'm going to roll with the, the uh, uh, Gabe, Vincent, and KCP, man. But wait. Tell the people what Prize Picks is. So, Prize Picks is a daily fantasy app. You pick two to six players, like the video on your screen. Then you pick if they will have more or less than their Prize Picks projection. You're not competing against other people. It's just you versus the projections available. Oh, look, look, look. I know how much I just won, but wait. Tell the people how much they can win on Prize Picks. So you can win up to 25 times your money on any entry. And on top of that, all first time users that deposit using our promo code podcast P will receive a hundred percent instant deposit match up to a hundred dollars. That mean if you deposit $20, prize picks will give you $20. If you deposit a hundred dollars, prize picks will give you a hundred dollars. And all I got to say, like I always do. Cha-ching!